Hi guys, so today is Friday and it's actually afternoon. So this morning I have been shooting content all morning and I've just sat down to have some lunch and I thought we could go through all my PR parcels that have arrived so I can have a little bit of a break from shooting. Um, there is quite a few so please do bear with me. There is quite a lot of parcels that have arrived. Um, I'm not sure if I'll get to my Zara stuff so if I don't I will do a separate video on that because it is quite a big order. Um, but anyway, yeah, let's go through what's arrived. Hopefully you enjoy it. I will do a little bit of a try on for some of the pieces as well. So let's get into it. So the first parcel that arrived is food, which they know the way to my heart. Um, one of the, part of it's already been eaten, but that wasn't me, that was Dan. Um, but I'll quickly show you what is inside. These have to be eaten quite quickly because they are donuts. How good do they look? I'm not a massive sweet tooth person, so I do like a good donut, but I don't like custard cream, all that sort of stuff. So I did go for the plain Jane versions of the donuts. So the next parcel that arrived is from a brand called Tweezerman. They sent me a DM on Instagram and asked if they could send me some bits. So, oh, there's quite a bit in here. So they sent me a little note, which is cute. Hannah, we hope you love your Tweezerman goodies. Let us know what you think. Love Tweezerman. So there's just a load of like sort of beauty products in there. So they've sent me eyelash curlers, a um, eyebrow brush and uh, spoolie, some nail files, which I actually really need those because I've almost run out. A little pocket size mirror. I'm not actually sure what this is. Oh, it's a lash guard. So you pop it on and then you do your mascara. So it stops you getting mascara all over your skin. That's actually really good. And then they have also sent me, which they asked me previously, some personalized tweezers. I don't think it's going to pick up on here. But it says my name there engraved, which is really cute. And I don't know if you're like me, but I literally lose my tweezers all the time. So... Fingers crossed I don't lose these. So the next parcel to arrive was this parcel from Clobo Jewelry. And already how gorgeous is the gift bag that it comes in. I am such a sucker when it comes to attention to detail on packaging. It also comes with a few little perfumes, which is a really nice added touch. And then they've got matching um, boxes. And then inside they've also got really nice like jewellery gift bags. I got a gorgeous ring, which I'll just pop on so you can see it in a bit more detail. Like a dainty dangly star on it, which is really cute. This I won't have to worry about taking off on holiday so I can just wear it. It's really comfortable because it's a bit like elasticated, I wanna say. So it's a bit less restrictive than some of my other rings that I wear. Um, so in this, I think that's Dan someone at the door hopefully the postman because i'm waiting on a h&m parcel um so then they've so also sent me this bracelet which is really cute as well and it actually matches which i just noticed the um ring that i just had on so this i will be able to oh god i don't want to break it there we go i'll be able to also sort of stack up with my other bracelets and then in the other box there is Oh, this one's nice. So it's just, again, another beaded bracelet, but half of it is pearl. My obsession with pearl has been throughout the entire summer. Um, I just think it's really nice. Like, gold and pearl together complement each other really well. Um, so I will continue to wear it through autumn and winter, I would imagine. Um, but, yeah, they look really nice, don't they? Next up, I received a parcel from a brand called Helix & Conch. They are an earring brand and as you can see I have a lot of ear piercings um, they've sent me a cute little note inside which is really nice and I've just realized that these are going to match my bracelet and my ring from Clobo Jewelry that was not planned however that makes me very happy um, I'm going to try and show you quickly so hopefully they will focus so they are like diamond star hoop earrings really dainty and perfect for every day i don't change my earrings very often because i don't ever tend to take them out unless it's my first hole and i've got like a big hoop in there um, but i like to have a stack of a few different hoops there so these will be a really nice addition to my ear 
and then they did also send me a conch piercing which i've already put in this is going to probably be a very unflattering angle but it's that hoop here and it just fits really really nicely on my ear it's a little bit sore where i had to change it um it literally closed up in about two minutes i had i took the earring out went to put the new one in and my hole closed up straight away so just be conscious of that if you're changing your conch piercing next up i received a huge parcel from sla the label which is sarah ashcroft's brand everything they bring out is gorgeous um they are like the queens of sparkle so you if you follow me on instagram you will be quite surprised with some of the pieces that i picked out i wanted to pick out a few colorful pieces and also plan forward for um christmas new year i know we're miles away but you've got to plan ahead so let's have a look what's inside here i wasn't lying when i said it was colorful so first up is this purple sparkly dress it's absolutely gorgeous this is one of the things that sla do really well is the sparkle they have sparkle suits um, and they always bring out some statement sparkly pieces when you come up to christmas and new year so this fits really really well i love that it's a bandeau mini dress and it's just a nice change from like a black standard dress especially if you want to if you've got some like special occasion coming up this would be the perfect dress for that next up is this pink cord which is pink cycling shorts and a little pink bralette i guess is this hot pink would you call this hot pink um this is very colourful, but also I do live in leggings and cycling shorts. I'm currently wearing cycling shorts now. Um, so this is a perfect piece, especially if you do want to add a bit of colour to your wardrobe. They also do sell it with, well, they don't sell it with, but you can buy a blazer, a pink blazer to match. It's a little bit creased. I do need to steam it. Um, but this is gorgeous. We know that I'm a sucker for blazers, so this was a no-brainer i think this would be really nice as well with black leggings and a black crop top as well just to add a little pop of color if you are maybe a little bit shorter than me because i'm five foot four and i think that this is a little bit short as a dress um but you can size up i just stuck to my true size but you can also wear it as a dress which is a really nice added extra to your wardrobe next up is probably the most surprising piece for me i was quite surprised when i picked it too um are you ready it is this orange sequin oversized shirt dress it's very bright it is very bright i know it's long enough on me to wear it as a dress so that's probably how i will wear it you could also wear it open um, it's sequin all over so a bit sparkly I went for a size extra small but obviously if you want it even more oversized then definitely size up in it this is really nice actually and I think with blonde hair this would go really really well so happy with this one next up I picked out a couple of silky pieces so first up is these white trousers they are wide leg trousers and they are very long i'm five foot four and they are quite long on me i think i would still be able to wear heels with them as well so if you are petite or smaller than five foot four i would just bear that in mind but they fit really really nicely on the waist they are an elastic waist and then I have also picked out this cow neck top that goes with the trousers. It falls really, really flattering on the chest and it's got a tie open back, which is a really cute addition. I always think cohorts are really great pieces to have in your wardrobe because you can wear them separately, which means you can wear them many, many ways. I have got hundreds, probably not hundreds, but I have got a lot of cohorts in my wardrobe. So I always like to have separate so that I can style them multiple different ways and then next up is my favorite favorite piece when i saw this on sarah ashcroft and sla said that it was coming soon i literally was like oh my god i have to have this the color is absolutely stunning so this cow neck green dress i wouldn't say it's lime green because it's not that bright 
um, but it's a midi dress it's got a little bit of a slit in the side and then it has a low open back which is absolutely gorgeous it fits really really flattering I went for a size extra extra small extra small and I've got quite a big bust but where it's got an open back you can adjust it so that it fits you nicely absolutely cannot wait to wear it I think this is going to look so nice with a pair of heels and a cute little bag and then last up I picked out another surprising piece to be honest but it is neutral I guess it is another co-ord though so I wasn't lying when I said I had hundreds of co-ords in my wardrobe it is this bandeau sparkly bandeau top and matching skirt so this is a long midi skirt and it's bodycon which I don't normally go for bodycon clothes just because I don't necessarily like the bloating I suffer from IBS and I always struggle with um, bodycon clothes after I've had a meal it's like a no pasta zone for me but this fits really really nicely and I'm gonna keep hold of this I think I'm gonna wear this potentially for New Year or Christmas definitely around that time I think paired with black heels and a sparkly bag is gonna be absolutely stunning so the last parcel that I've got is from a brand called Nadine Marabi if you've not heard of them before they are a bit more on the luxury pricey side but that is because the tailoring and the quality of the products are amazing I've had a pajama set from them before and it was absolutely beautiful I feel like this box as well you could use it for storing stuff or it would just look really nice in a room I think inside it comes with I don't know what these are called but you know like where you put your suits in to carry with them um, it comes with one of those. Wow, these are actually even more beautiful in person. This dress gives me um, like engagement bridal vibes, which kind of makes me wish that Dan could propose to me all over again so I could wear it. I know you can't normally plan what you're wearing because you don't know you're going to get proposed to, but this would be the perfect dress. It's this like beaded midi dress and how beautiful is it? I don't know if it's going to show up that well on camera focusing but it's like um white knit, not knitted white embroidered beaded midi dress and it's got a long train detail on the bottom it's not obviously going to show very well with me holding it like this but I can just tell in person the tailoring is absolutely beautiful and where it's got like a nude underdress it makes it look like obviously beading on skin which is going to be absolutely beautiful the next piece that I picked out, I actually saw it on Sophie Maud's, um, which if you don't follow her on Instagram, have a look. She's got a hot pink version. It's absolutely beautiful. A two-piece, which I know I don't need another co ord because all I've talked about in this video is co ords But it is, again, I don't know how well it's going to show, but I will be planning on shooting this outfit as well. It is a sort of bustier corset boob tube, and then it's got a long train which goes all the way down to the, the bottom of where your trousers will sit which is absolutely gorgeous I need to try it on so I'm hoping it fits me okay and then I got a pair of matching trousers to go with them so they are wide leg long trousers she did ask me my heel height and my actual height so I'm not sure I'd have to check but I think that you can get them like tailored by them to what your individual needs are so obviously if you are petite or if you're on the taller side it can be quite hard to find a suitable pair of trousers so um, I will double check that but I'm pretty sure you can get different leg lengths these are absolutely gorgeous they don't look like they're going to be see-through at all um, so I'm really excited to wear that as a two-piece with the corset top they are Nadine Marabi on Instagram and they have a website it's spelt like that if you want to have a look that is all of my pr parcels for this week hopefully you enjoyed it if you want to see more unboxings in my vlogs then please do let me know in the comments below um i'm gonna get back to shooting now i'm gonna make myself some lunch and then i've got a little bit more home content to do and then 
tomorrow we are heading into London to shoot some outfit pictures, street style, which I'm really excited about as I haven't actually been to London in a little while now. So I'm going to plan a few outfits tonight to get those ready for tomorrow and pack up the car. Um, but yeah, I need to crack on with all of that. So I will catch up with you guys when we are in London tomorrow. Mm -hmm.